Welcome back to our STEM subject series. I'm Abigail Rebulalan to share with you the topics that would be discussed towards your next step as being a grade 11 science, technology, engineering, and mathematics student. But before we start, don't forget to like and subscribe for more of our video updates. And if you have not yet watched our previous videos, and if you want to watch the next part of this video, please do so and check the description below for more of our videos. So let's start. Good day, everyone. So today, I will be sharing to you the personal development topics for grade 11 STEM for the first semester. And this is the part one for our video presentation. If you want to know more about personal development topics, you can do so by checking the description below. So for unit one, it's about self-development. I'll be sharing with you the content standard for each lesson. The learners demonstrate an understanding of. So for the next slide, that's, that will be our discussion all about. So for lesson one, two, three, and four, what are the learning outcomes and the possible topics that would be discussed in this lesson? So we'll have a glimpse for each lesson. Okay, so lesson one is about knowing oneself, understanding oneself during middle and late adolescence. The learning outcome for this lesson would be a deeper understanding about himself or herself during middle and late adolescence. Next, for lesson two, developing the whole person. And the learning outcome for this lesson would be the various aspects of holistic development, such as physiological, cognitive, psychological, spiritual, and social development. Next, for lesson three, we have here the developmental stages in middle and late adolescence. Here, the discussion will be about the skills and tasks appropriate for middle and late adolescence and preparatory to early adulthood. And lastly, for lesson four, it's about the challenges in middle and late adolescence. So the, lear the learning outcome would be the developmental changes in middle and late adolescence and expectations of and from adolescents. So now let's go on to the unit two of personal development is about aspects of personal development. So just like from unit one, I will be sharing to you as well the content standard for each lesson in unit two, lessons five, six, seven, eight. So the learners demonstrate an understanding of, so for each lesson, I'll be sharing it with you. So lesson five, it's about coping with stress in middle and late adolescence. So for the learning outcome, stress and its sources, various stress responses and coping strategies for helpful living in middle and late adolescence. The next lesson would be about the powers of the mind. Okay. So in this lesson, it's about the whole brain theory or two hemispheres of the brain, which are artistic or the right brain dominant and the linear or the left brain dominant. And for lesson seven, it's about mental health and well-being in middle and late adolescence. So the learning outcome for this lesson is about the concepts about mental health and well-being in middle and late adolescents. And for the last lesson for unit two, emotional intelligence. So in this lesson, the different types of emotions and how they are expressed would be discussed, such as happiness, sadness, anger, and many more. So for the summary, unit one is about self-development, 
Lesson 1, Knowing Oneself. Lesson 2, Developing the Whole Person. Next, we have here for Lesson 3, Developmental Stages in Middle and Late Adolescence. And lastly, the challenges of middle and late adolescence. Now for the Unit 2, it's about aspects of personal development. For Lesson 5, Coping with Stress in Middle and Late Adolescence. For Lesson 6, Powers of the Mind. Next, for Lesson 7, Mental Health and Well-Being in Middle and Late Adolescence. And for Lesson 8, Emotional Intelligence. So before we end, I would like to share with you Philippians 4.13, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. I hope that this video presentation help you to have a glimpse of what would be the topics for grade 11 STEM in the subject personal development. Thank you for listening and have a good day. Thank you and God bless. Remember to like and subscribe.